Hello, welcome to Easy Channel. In this video, I will show you how to create a new analysis by Odoo Models. Here I'm in Odoo. Click on Easy Analytic Module and you will see the dashboard that I already created. To create a new analysis, click plus button and click Add Analysis. Click New Analysis button. Fill in the name of the analysis. Choose the data source, click on Odoo, and then choose the method for creating the analysis. For now I will show you the Odoo model method. Next, we need to select the table that we want to use for the analysis. For example, I choose the product template table. Choose the date field that we will use for date filter later. You can also choose the category of the analysis. Next, you will see the All Configuration button. If you activate this button, you will see several tabs appears. You can add filter to the data in Domain menu. For example, I want to filter the data by its product type. I only want to choose the storable product, you can see the data change from 42 records to 34 records. If you are done with the data source, click on Visualize button. In this menu you can change the visualization of your data. The first thing that I'm going to change is the metrics and the dimension. I will choose sales price as the metrics. We can change the calculation of the data, for now I want to see the average of the sales price. And then, I want to select the name of the product as the dimension. We can sort the data in this menu. Click on the data you want to sort. For now I want to sort the sales price by the largest, so I choose descending. We can also limit the data that we want to see on the dashboard. For example, I only want to see top 10 sales price of products in the dashboard. We just need to fill the field with 10. If you're done with the data, we can click on Visual tab. In this menu, you can choose any type of visual that's suitable for your data. I choose the pie chart for now. We can change the inner radius of the circle, the circle type, enable the label series, and change the label position. Next, we can go back to the dashboard to see the changes. Now, I already show you how to add a new analysis with Odoo models. Go try it out on our website demo.izzyapp.id. Thank you and have a nice day.